And then our last cars we're going to take a look at are these uh, Trinity Covered Hoppers from the Master Plus series that Atlas has. And these are great looking cars. I particularly love this one. If you notice, it has brand new roller bearings there. You can see that they're still painted blue. And then, of course, I have the more been on the railroad for a while, so the blue has gone away. But a great looking design. These are incredibly detailed looking cars here. If you notice, we have metal couplers. We got metal wheels. We got a bunch of various different parts. As a matter of fact, if I take this one apart you're, or off the track, you're going to see just all the different detailing that we have here, the various different hoses and whatnot. I mean, this is just a fantastic looking piece for the value that you're getting here. These cars sell for $39.99. Of course, you are paying for the detail in there, but you're definitely going to the head of the class if you want to get some really nice, fine, detailed looking rolling stock for your train to pull. All right, so now I got the ACF 60 foot auto part box cars, and these are great looking pieces. As you can see, I have a couple out here. These are the single doors, and if you take a look, once again, I got a lot of great detailing happening. As a matter of fact, on this Conrail one, you can see the overspray. A lot of times they don't actually bother to spray the roof of these things, and that is detailed there. Atlas did a great job with that design. Now, these are the double door box cars, as you can see. So I have a couple of different variations. And these cars sell for $25.16. And once again, that is a great value for what you are getting. All right, so now it's time to take a look at some of the high-end products that we just had got in coming in from Broadway Limited. And we're going to be taking a look at the P5A Pennsylvania Railroad Box Cab, and this is a beautiful-looking engine. Why don't we check this guy out here? If you can see here, I got one of the more unique electric locomotives that you will see on the railroad. And, of course, it has everything that you would expect from Broadway Limited. you got the incredible detailing here. We have the pantographs that do go down and do come up uh, manually, of course. But it looks fantastic. And it has a whole bunch of different lighting features. And just like we usually do, let's start this sucker up. lights we got there, the indication lights there. It's a really neat looking engine here. These sell for $429.99, but we're selling them at Yankee Dappler for $299.99, and it's a great deal to have for Quite honestly, a very unique looking locomotive that you can have on your layout. So come on in and check it out because just like the Hudson's, I don't think these guys are going to last too long. All right, so we pretty much covered a whole bunch of manufacturers and we're going to do one more for you. This is from Mike's Train House. We have here a brand new uh, HO locomotive that I think you guys will like. Check out this guy here. This is the ES44AC 
CXX Veterans Locomotive, and this is a great design piece. If you take a look here, you see the camouflage design. You see the honoring our veterans on the cab there. This, of course, is the number 1776. Obviously, we know why they chose that number. And if you even look at the back, you're going to see some silhouettes of veterans kneeling there. This is a great-looking locomotive from Mike's Train House, and just like we do with all the other engines, let's start her up. Here's the horn. And the bell. And I like the operating ditch lights every time the horn blows. They oscillate like that. Beautiful looking horn. Like a real thing. All right, we're gonna back her up here. Let's see the backup light turn on. So this is a great locomotive if you want to add it to your fleet. They are retailing for $309.99. We're selling with our store for $249.99. It is a great piece to add to your uh, collection. So you might be wondering, hmm, what am I going to buy? Well, it looks like we got a couple of things that might be on that list to come check in. So as I would say in The Mandalorian, it is the way. All right, well, I want to thank you all for tuning in to our uh, latest episode to see what was brand new at Yankee Dabbler. If you're not already subscribed to Engineer Hall, what are you waiting for? Click that subscribe button and get caught up on all the brand new videos that we're going to be posting here at the store and, of course, on Engineer Hall's layout. I think there's a lot of cool things that are going to be planned for 2021, so I can't wait to go for the ride. So from everyone here at Yankee Dabbler, thank you so much for tuning in, and we'll see you again next time here because, after all, you know, Every day is a train show. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye.